Hello, welcome to my YouTube channel, which provides geography videos to students and teachers across the UK. These videos have a focus on geographical content and exam skill and can be used at Key Stage 3, GCSE and A-Level. In this video, I will provide an outline of the different types of waves found along coastlines and I will explain how these different types of waves influence the shape of the beach. The force and power of waves is one of the biggest factors in creating physical changes along the coastline. Waves are formed by fast moving winds blowing across the surface of the sea or ocean. When the wind blows over the surface of the water, friction is created, which causes a swell in the body of the water. Small particles within the water then begin to rotate inside the swell. It is this that moves the waves forward towards the coastline. The size and power of the wave is influenced by the following three factors. Number one, the strength of the wind. Number two, how long the wind has been blowing over the surface of the sea. And lastly, number three, the distance the wave has actually traveled which is known as the fetch. Although all waves are different, there are two main types, constructive and destructive. Both of these waves, constructive and destructive, have different characteristics in their appearance and structure. This makes it possible to clearly identify the two different types of wave. Constructive waves such as these ones behind me can be identified by the following characteristics. The crests, which is the top part of each wave, is generally quite far apart. The front of each wave is gently sloping. 
And when the front wave breaks onto the beach, it has a powerful swash, which on sandy beaches will push the sediment up the beach and construct the beach. Destructive waves can be identified by the following characteristics. The wave crests are generally quite close together. The front wave is generally quite steep. And lastly, when the front wave breaks onto the beach, it plunges downwards and drags the sediment back with it. This creates a steep beach. Thank you for watching my video on the characteristics of waves. I hope it does support you in your geography lessons. Please do subscribe to my YouTube channel for many more geography videos just like this one, which will support and guide you through your geography GCSE or A-level.